Hello, YouTube. How's it going? I haven't seen you guys in a while. So, it's just after Christmas. My parents just got me a nice new set of drum heads. I figured it would be fun to do a little comparison video. My old heads versus the new ones, especially since the old heads are EC2s and the new ones are hydraulics. Figured I'd give them a shot. Let's see what happens. Oh, by the way, sorry for the shitty audio. This is a video I'm doing kind of on a whim here. So I really just, I did not plug in a mic or anything. I'm just going for it. So let's get rocking. Just in case you were wondering, no, I am not using triggers for this video, obviously. That would kind of be pointless if we're comparing drum heads now, wouldn't it? Oh my God, we finally get to hear what his drum set sounds like without triggers. And just another little disclaimer here, the EC2 heads that I currently have on my kit are obviously like, you know, more than a year old. So it's not a perfectly controlled experiment. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the little comparison and uh, let me know in the comments which heads you like better. I'm also curious to uh, hear what some of you think how my real drums sound compared to the triggers because I still think the triggers sound better. You know, everyone's obviously entitled to their own opinion. When I'm recording real drums like this, there's a lot more work involved to get it to sound as good as the sample sound. I don't know what to tell you. The triggers and samples are just a lot easier for me, especially when making videos and trying to get them done fast, because, you know, editing a music video is lots of hard work. Plus, whenever you record drums with real microphones and all that stuff, there's always so much bleed. There's always a bunch of snare bleed in the tom mics, like literally on the snare track, you have to take out all the toms whenever the snare's not being played, and for the tom track, you gotta cut out all the snares whenever that's not being played, and it's just so much fucking work, dude. Why is there always dust on this shit? You know what? I think I'm gonna do a triggers versus no triggers video pretty soon. I think that'd be fun. All right, that's it. I guess I'm done rambling. I guess the video is over now. I guess you can, you know, get back to what you were doing before you were watching my stupid shit. And we'll see you next week.